I was just coming up to see you and Georgie. Georgie's with her dolls. She's got them spread out all over her lap telling them about the divorce. But how they don't have to worry, their family still loves them. I know that's what you and Mac told Georgie. But you can be honest with me. Divorce means that we won't really be a family. We'll only see each other sometimes. Mac's not like that. You know how much he loves you. He said that he was going to be a part of your life. And he means it. Mom, I know what you did with Mr. Spencer. And that's why you're getting a divorce, right? Because you're in love with him. No. I've made some mistakes. You can't marry him, Mom. You, we can't live with Mr. Spencer. Mac would never come to see us. Maxie, listen to me. I love Mac. But we're going to live apart. And you, Georgie, and I are going to live in this house as a family. And he will come and visit us. Don't let your imagination take you places that aren't real. Why does Mac always do what's right for you? But you never do what's right for him. Mac's always good to me. And I want to be just as good to him. Then why aren't you? Because I've made some mistakes and I'm... And I've told him that I'm really sorry. I know how much this is hurting you and I would do anything to just to be able to just snap my fingers and make it all go away, but I can't. Why does it have to be like this? It's gonna get better. I promise you. It's gonna get better. It's just gonna take time. I see a girl who needs cheering up. I'm okay. I'm gonna go get some ice cream. I've got homework. Can you just bring me a vanilla milkshake? It'll be a lot more fun if you join us next time, okay? Okay. But we'll be quick. I'll have you back in 20 minutes. I should really get started on my homework. Okay. Don't open up the door to any strangers. You want to carry that for me? <laughs> 